Hey everybody, it's Taylor with Boys and Grove, and today we're gonna make a bat lift. Let's get into it. Growing up during the 80s and 90s, I was introduced to a particular world through this show. Star Trek. Star Trek rules. And as a kid, one of my favorite characters was this guy. The Klingon. Mainly because of their super cool, huge weapons that they carried called the bat lift. And I think one of those would make an awesome addition to the wall of my shop. I started by finding a picture online and blowing it up to a one-to-one -one scale and printing it out. I use a scrap piece of three quarter inch plywood for my bat lift. Yes, I know it's pretty thick, but I really wanted the blade edges to be pretty prominent. Plus, it's mine and I can do whatever I want. Using the jigsaw to cut it out did take a minute, but I used a clean cutting wood blade and it came out really nice. I use my palm router to put a large chamfer on all the edges that should be sharp and a round over on all the rest of the edges. Because this is plywood, there were a few voids, so I used wood epoxy to fill these and any areas where there were noticeable marks. Wood epoxy gets rock hard, but it's still sandable, so it was perfect for this application. After a few more times of applying the epoxy and more sanding than I care to recall, it was ready to paint. An idea I got from Bill over at Punish Props is to do a base coat in gloss black and this will help enhance the metallic look. After a few coats of the gloss black, I applied a few coats of metallic silver. For the grips, I cut up some leather scraps that I had laying around and used high temp hot glue to apply them. I don't have any leather working tools, so I just used a lighter to kind of burnish the edges of the leather and get rid of any of the fuzzy looking spots. All right, my bat lift is done. I think this thing is super cool and it was a pretty short project. It didn't take very long at all. Without the certificate of authenticity, that bat lift is worthless. Before I hang it on the wall of my shop, I'm gonna take it outside and swing it around a little bit. Let's go.
I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you like these types of projects, let me know in the comments below. We put out a new project video every week, so make sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell. Thank you very much for watching. Be safe and have a great day.